What's going on guys, it's Raul TV, Team R4UL on Ramadan Eve, that is Ramadan tomorrow and we're on Ramadan Eve today. So to, from, tomorrow, from tomorrow the diet starts, go in, go home starts, we've got no choice, we have to, <laughs> it starts anyway. Uh, so what we're doing now is we've got a BMW 320 diesel on 2012 and we're going to go ahead and replace the fuel filter, it's a diesel one, 320 diesel, we're going to go ahead and replace the fuel filter, like I mentioned, I don't know why I'm repeating myself, but yeah. It's not the hardest job in the world. The only hard bit is if you're doing it on the floor, it's going to make your life a bit hard because you have to take this big massive cover off and that's, that's, that's the downside. But besides that, it's straightforward. Anyway, let's go ahead, replace the uh, fuel filter. Let's go. Okay, first things first, what we're going to do is we have to take this big massive cover off. So we have to take this cover off. Okay, the fuel filter lives in there. We don't need to take this cover off, the front one. We don't need to take that off, but we do need to take these screws off from the front cover that is so we need to take this back cover off so 8 mil we're gonna go ahead and take these off this one this one this one another one here another one there one at the back there one here and yeah that's about it take this cover off and we'll go from there right so the next thing what we're gonna do is we took this big massive cover off we're gonna take this little jubilee clip off you can get a 7mm socket or a flat screwdriver, take that off. As you can see there, that Jubilee clip is absolutely totally off, the pipe is nearly off. We're going to leave that there for now. What we'll do is we're going to go ahead and take this 13mm off, 13mm bolt, take that off. I've slackened that one as well, it's a Torx 20, slacken that, just, just slacken it, don't take it off. Slacken that one, we're going to go ahead and take this one off and get the socket on there that is. Boom, take that one off, just make sure you hold the bolt. Oh, check that one out, bad boy, yeah. Right then what we do is we just get that Torx 20 and just undo that one. I've already cracked it, remember, slackened it. So undo that one, take that off totally. Move that out of the way. Okay, after we've taken that off, we can just leave that there for now. We'll go to this side here, this uh, little clip we need to just take that off, so just get a flat screwdriver and ping that off. Flat screwdriver, sorry about the noise in the background, just ping that off like that. Boom, there we go. That comes off. All you do is just pry that little unit off, this unit here, just pry that off. It will come off eventually, just a little bit of persuading, persevere. Take that side off and then we'll go ahead and take this pipe off, or you can take this pipe off then take that off, it's entirely up to you. Yeah, let's take this off. Right, there we have it, there's the new filter. The old one, obviously, just, just take it off. Um, you can't really go wrong. I'm just gonna bang it back on there, make sure you got some seals on there. Okay, put it on there, get the clip on, put it on this side, get the Jubilee clip back on, bolt it up, finish it off, let's go. Filter is back on there. I'm trying to do this with one hand, guys, so basically, I mean, it's not rocket science, just get that clip on there and just push it down. It will go down, it's just, I just can't do it with one hand. Uh, you let me get both hands on it or get some pliers on there, just uh, push that down, it should go down. Happy days, let's go. So there we go, that's on. Obviously I got my right hand on there and uh, got, then give it a bit of persuading, it did go on there. So there we go, that's on there. What we do now is we're gonna get the clamp, get the clamp on there, measure it up to that, okay, that bolt hole there, and put the clamp on. After putting the clamp on, we'll put this side on, the pipe on there. And that's about it, put the cover on, jobs are good un. Okay guys, there we go, all done and dusted, that's tightened up, this clamp is back on, that's back on with the clip and everything. Right, as for this one here, okay, this rubber, obviously you need to get it in there, okay, and uh, get the, there's a little sleeve that goes on as well, then the 30 milli nut goes on. Uh, it's really, really hard to get that rubber on, so what, what I did is cut the rubber, so it's two halves, You'll, you'll, when you get to it, you'll see it. Uh, cut the rubber in half, so then it's two halves, then one half on the top, one half on the bottom. Happy days, that's on, that's not going anywhere. Got the Torx 20 back on, that's done. Let's get the cover back on, let's start it up. Let's go. Well, that's it guys, there we have it, all done and dusted. That's how we replace the fuel filter on a BMW 320 diesel 2012. I mean, it's not the easiest, I mean, it's not the hardest job in the world, actually. Uh, I mean, not the easiest in the world, because you have to take the big massive cover off. But uh, once you get the cover off, rest of it, you know, taking the pipe off, taking the, taking the clip off, 
it's pretty much uh, okay simple anyway i hope this video helps you guys out if it didn't help you guys out i'm sorry I'm trying my best please like share and subscribe to my channel hit the bell button for me leave a comment in the comment section raul tv team r4ul we'll see you guys next time